All right, for the last couple of weeks, Newsnet5.com has asked you to send in your Halloween pictures. Yeah, well, one recent submission was so captivating, we had to send our Ted Cortan out to get the story behind the werewolf and the bat. As soon as I saw this classic picture, I just had to meet the kids in the costumes. So I went to their Rocky River home, which of course was appropriately decorated by you-know-who... <laughs> They are the Chronister sisters, and that's their artistic mom, Jennifer, who made the costumes. I'm a bat, and I'm a werewolf. The bat with the glittery wings is seven-year-old Olivia, and that's her nine-year-old sister, Madeline, with the hideous green fangs and werewolf costume. Mom explains what happened as she tried to get some photos of the girls in their Halloween outfits. Suddenly, the bat decided to attack the werewolf, and she jumped down. And... I was running away, so she went to land right on me. So did she? No, I landed on my feet. Now, the girls were more than happy to recreate the scene for me, even the leap with our microphone in hand. Moments later, a friendly dispute over the mic led to this wild scene. No, I'm on the mic. And as the werewolf chased the bat around the living room, I was reminded just how precious these childhood holiday memories are. We love that picture and, you know, they love looking at it. And as I said, it's just, it's a once in a lifetime moment. Happy Halloween! And thank you, Chronister family, for sharing it with us. On your side in Rocky River, I'm Ted Cortan, News Channel 5. That's really, really cute. You, really cool. You think you can beat that? No, I don't. But hey, if you think you can, you can go to newsnet5.com, submit your pictures as well. People are going to start using all sorts of like fishing line now to be hanging from the ceiling. That's a perfect picture. Perfect picture. Well done.